Hey everybody, welcome back. This is me, Luke Mick here, and this is my review for Maleficent. So Maleficent is the new Sleeping Beauty live-action reboot or reimagining, whatever you'd like to call it, and it stars Angelina Jolie as Maleficent and Charlotte Copley as the king of the land. That's pretty much what he is. Now this movie was one that I really wasn't looking forward to. I'm not a big fan of these Disney live-action reboots of these older cartoons or movies like Oz the Great and Powerful and Alice in Wonderland. They just don't really appeal to me. I, I don't like their fantasy elements that much and this movie is definitely trying really hard to be like a Lord of the Rings epic story but then it also has these other moments in the movie um, these other kind of more toned down scenes where you really get to the heart of the characters that I personally enjoyed more so right off the bat I'm just gonna say this Angelina Jolie is magnificent as Maleficent she plays the role very very well she fits right into it she gives it a lot of heart and a lot of emotion is put into her role and I thought she did a very good job Charlotte Copeland as well in this movie. He was okay. I mean, I, I like him as an actor a lot. I loved him in District 9 and Elysium and even the A-Team, but I, I don't think that his character in this movie, I mean, he was developed and he did have a relationship with um, Angelina Jolie's character of Maleficent, but I feel like his motives and some of the decisions that his character made and the actions he took to sort of prevent certain events from happening didn't make a whole lot of sense. I didn't really like his role in the movie. I liked him, but I didn't really like his character that much. Now, something that I really don't like about this movie is its Lord of the Rings style action sequences. Um, half of the time in this movie, Angelina Jolie has wings, and every time she's flying around with her wings, the green screen and the special effects are just awful. I'm sorry to say it, but the special effects team did not do a great job when they were demonstrating Angelina Jolie's powers with her wings. I thought it looked really silly. I was actually kind of chuckling a lot when I saw her flying through the battlefield. It was just really, really corny, and I wasn't a big fan of the action scenes, but the scenes that I did like, as a matter of fact, are the more hard heartfelt and emotional scenes where Maleficent is watching Sleeping Beauty as a child growing up in this cottage um, in the in the woods. But I like the, the more toned down scenes where Maleficent was actually showing her emotions so we could see that she actually cared for this child. Honestly, I don't know why this movie was made. I don't think it was really that necessary. I mean, it wasn't an awful movie by any means, but I just don't see the point in it. It was basically just a, a retelling and a rehash of Sleeping Beauty, but with a different twist on it, but I honestly don't know who was demanding this movie and who really wanted to see this movie, because to be honest with you guys, I didn't want to see this movie, and I don't really care for the story that much or the characters. It just isn't really something that I care that much about. So I'm going to give Maleficent 2 out of 5 stars. It's decent. If you guys like these live-action Disney reboots of sorts, you guys would probably like this movie. If you like any of the Disney princesses, you'll probably like it as well. But I just didn't think that it was very interesting to me.